Hey guys, it's me, Clint, from uh, Bucket List Bars. Now, listen, we don't normally do this, um, but today I'm going to make a drink for you. And uh, if you like it, maybe we'll do a few more. Now, the reason I'm making this drink is because today's kind of special. See, I live in southern New Mexico where it never snows. But today it snowed like gangbusters. And so today I'm going to make a, a very special cocktail. It was... Um, Written actually recorded by Charles Dickens and because it's close to Christmas. I think that's kind of a, Kind of a, a, a good cocktail to make it's called the Rocky Mountain sneezer And it can only be made with fresh snow according to Dickens anyway uh, It has a few other ingredients and uh, I'll go through them today as, uh, as I'm making them for you And then I'll take a drink. I've never tried it before, but uh, we'll see what it tastes like Now here's the other part of the recipe. It calls for fresh fallen snow. Now, when Dickens was made this, it was in New York City in about 1867. God only knows what that snow was like. But out here in New Mexico, we have fresh fallen snow all over the place. So I'm gonna scrape a little bit from my car and uh, hopefully get enough. And I know it sounds kind of disgusting, but I don't wanna get you off the street. So I guess this will have to do. All right, so now we have the Rocky Mountain Sneezer from Charles Dickens, so let's give it a shot. Whew, that's sour. <laughs> but it's good, you know, it's good. Uh, you get the bitters in there right at the start. The, uh, the lemon hits you. You're not tasting the spirits at all. There's enough sugar in here to, to uh, keep it down. All in all, a really good drink. Uh, Charles Dickens reportedly drank this because he had a really bad cold. I think this would probably cure just about anything that ails you. So, from Charles Dickens, uh, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. From Bucketless Bars, I'm Clint Lanier. Cheers.